Castle travel millions of light years from home in the science fiction action adventure, Stargate. I knew it. For two months, cast and crew braved the extremes of desert shooting to create the harsh and alien world on the other side of the Stargate. This is, this is an undertaking the size and, uh, of which I've never been involved with. It's a great journey, you know, literally uh, going to uh, another planet. Sand everywhere. On equipment, in equipment, transportation is a virtual impossibility. There is a, a, a fascinating material called GeoWeb. It's a honeycomb material. They actually use it in Desert Storm. And it's laid down in the sand and it creates literally an instant road. We never would have been able to move around the desert without, without that. My very first day on the set, the scale of the picture became absolutely clear to me. I was driven straight into the desert, into a series of sand dunes, where waiting for us were thousands of extras. Trailing out over, I'd say, two miles, crests of these dunes. Every day was a new enormity. The size of the film would indeed be uh, analogous to what Cecil B. DeMille was doing. And I say that with utter humility. He used over 16,000 extras. In the middle of a sequence, we're supposed to have thousands of extras throwing their fists and cheering. We suddenly got the wave. I don't think it'll play. A constant supply of water kept the filmmakers from succumbing to the intense desert heat. I asked somebody, I said, geez, it's pretty warm today. He said, yeah, it's 126. <laughs> In all honesty, it was very, very tough on the crew because they were hauling equipment around those dunes and they were hauling them long distances. And stuff. Uh, for us, it was kind of a party. Uh, my makeup man and I would <laughs> get the opportunity to jump in a dune buggy and ride dune buggies around. Heat, movement, and the occasional sandstorm were nothing compared to a challenge the filmmakers would face daily. Tracks. When you first arrive at a sand dune, it's perfect, and there's those great little ripples, and it looks fantastic. The minute one person steps on it, you're done. Back to one, back to one. It's a very difficult process just to get any movie made. Get a movie like this made is, uh, it's really, an, it's, it's an undertaking and when you get it done, it's, a, it's just an achievement just to, just to have made it, just to have done it. 